Hi guys, good morning and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a new release video for the past four weeks of new releases. I have not done a new release video for the entire month of June and I've had new releases every single week. So we have four weeks worth of releases to go through in this video. It is going to be a long one, but I do think these videos are incredibly valuable to you guys as customers because you can really see everything up close. You can see the foil. You can see everything. I just think that it's worth doing. And I wanted to just sit down today while James is still asleep and get this video filmed for you guys. So I'm going to be working backwards, starting with the releases that just released yesterday and then doing each release week together moving backwards over the last four weeks. Starting with the items that released yesterday, we have two exclusive, actually all three of them are exclusive art. We have two new ones and one that is a reformat from last year's Summer Mystery. So I'm excited to show you all of these and let's just get right into it. So first of all, we have this exclusive collection called Palm Leaves. This is absolutely gorgeous. I considered not releasing it this year and saving it for next year just because of everything happening with the virus, less people are traveling. But I feel like this is more of like a like dream type collection. Like you could use this just when you're dreaming of the beach. It's not like super literal looking. It's very like just beautiful and dreamy and I love the colors so I thought it would be a good collection to release. I do have a couple of like more beachy exclusive art collections that I just decided to hold off and release next year but this one I thought you guys would really enjoy and the colors of this collection are so beautiful. This pink is just like the most beautiful neon pink in real life. The printers did a really really good job with printing this exact color. I am loving it. So here are your full boxes and then we have check boxes with some like palm leaves. You have two extra boxes there, functional stickers, functional page, deco and scripts, washi and headers, icons and littles, duo bottom washi glitter washi and date covers. And I do have new style date covers that launched at some point in the last four weeks. I don't think you guys have seen it on camera yet but they are really, really, really pretty, and I love that they have all of the featured colors included. So those are your main eight pages for palm leaves, and then you also get the glitter headers included. That was the Lux. I also have all collections, I'm pretty sure, that will be in this entire video releasing in a mini and a bitty as well. So I'm gonna show you the format in this first collection, and then I'm not going to for the rest. I will just, you can just assume that there's a mini and a bitty available and I'll let you know if there are any collections that that is not true, but I don't think so. So for the mini, you get five pages. You do get the full box page. You get the functional page. You get a mini exclusive page. You get the deco and scripts page and the washi and date covers page. You can add on glitter headers and items like that a la carte if you want. We also have the little two page bitty kit, which has four full boxes icons, some functional stickers, and it also comes with the functional page. So my little two page bitty. For this collection, I do have some a la carte items that you can pick up. First of all, I do have the A5 and personal side washi option. I have the label add on option. And we also have fashion boxes for this collection. They're not included in the Lux because there are four different versions, but you do get three boxes. So this is version one, version two, version three, and version four. Next, we have a reformat of last year's summer mystery kit, which was called Boardwalk. This was voted back as the number one most requested collection from last summer to be brought back. So I have gone ahead and reformatted this for you guys in the most recent format. So I will run through that and then I will also show you what it looks like laid down because I did use this collection last year in my own planner. Okay, so you do get your eight main pages. You get the full boxes. It is boardwalk themed. I know a lot of people aren't going to the boardwalk this summer, but people wanted this collection brought back anyway because it's just such a quintessential summer collection that you can either save or you can use as kind of like a dream collection the way Palm Leaves is as well. So here are the full boxes, check boxes, extra boxes. I think I did make the colors a little bit different this time and then we have the functional page, the deco and scripts, 
headers and washi icons and littles bottom washi glitter washi and date covers and again we have the new style date covers and this one is in a different font so i am kind of changing up the font that to kind of like match the theme and the look of the collection and i felt like that font worked a little bit better than the like more delicate script font for this collection and then you do get your tall fashion girls included you get your glitter headers and you get your double box so that was the luxe kit i also have this kit available in a mini and a bitty these are the four boxes that come in the bitty and i do have the a5 and personal side washi add-on and the label add-on that you can pick up so i wanted to show you what this looked like in my own planner when i used it last year and this is what it looked like it's super bright it's super fun i didn't go to a boardwalk this week i literally picked the collection because i had this picture of james for the week and i loved how the neon yellow just matched the colors so here's an example of how you can use it even if you don't actually go to a boardwalk it's just so bright so colorful i loved it i loved using this collection and i was so happy that you guys liked it so much that you wanted it brought back so that was boardwalk and then the last new collection for this week that just launched yesterday is the newest addition to my disney kit line and it is a tarzan inspired collection this is called in my heart and it is so so pretty i love it like this is just the best jungle aesthetic kit i've ever seen i love it i had this art done months ago and i had it slotted to release um maybe like a month ago or five weeks ago and there was some shop art that was released that was tarzan themed and a lot of shops used it it was non-exclusive art and so it kind of got like oversaturated in the community i felt like a lot of shops were using tarzan art and i just decided to push my release because i just wanted it to be kind of special so anyway here are the full boxes look at the scene of like the bed cabana in the treehouse it's so good and then you have check boxes extra boxes functional deco and scripts headers and washi icons and littles dual bottom washi glitter washi and date covers again i used the script for the for these date covers so i'm definitely like changing up the date covers depending on the theme of the collection and the feel of the collection and then you do get glitter headers included you get this beautiful double box of this treehouse like look at that omg i want to live there and you get these extra boxes of the two animals so that was the in my heart collection i do have the collection available of course in a mini and a bitty as well so these are the bitty boxes and then i do have the a5 and personal side washi and the leopard print you could pick this up and use it with other collections too because it's like a neutral you know animal print and then we also have the label add-on and then also we have foil overlay options for this collection which is so exciting you guys are obsessed when I add foil overlays. So I do have three different overlays for this collection and I'm gonna show you what they look like laid down. First of all, we have a green foil overlay. So this is called the In My Heart Green Overlay. We also have a gold overlay because I couldn't decide between the two colors and I just thought these two colors together worked so well for the collection. So this one is called In My Heart Gold. And then we also have the green washi overlay. And this could be used for other collections as well. This one is not collection specific. The other two are, but this one you could use anytime you wanted a green overlay. So picking this up and having this as a specialty foil color in your collection for other collections that you want to overlay in green is a good idea so that's why i made this not collection specific but for the washi you do get your overlay washi strips and then these are all half cut headers here and then for this one you have four full box overlays and these are all half cut headers and then for this one you have four overlays one double box overlay and then a few half cut headers down here so i'm going to show you what it looks like when you have it down on your items so first of all for the gold overlay um the bottom two boxes here go over the alternative scene in the lux so it highlights the umbrella and also the hats so pretty and then the top two boxes it's going to highlight jane's shirt and then also the cabana so these two boxes here so pretty 
So that was the gold overlay, and then this is an example of what the um, green glitter overlay looks like on the bottom washi. And then for the um, green in my heart overlay, first of all, you do have the double box overlay, which is gorgeous, like this is everything. Even if you didn't wanna pick up the other two sheets, I would definitely recommend picking up the In My Heart Green just for this double box overlay because it's stunning. And then you also get four um, full box overlays on your full boxes. So these bottom two go here. So you have the Tarzan and then you have the other half of the scene here. And then the top boxes here go over this bridge full box and then also the music full box, as you can see. So those were the three collections for this week. Now I'm going to show you the teeny releases for the week. So first of all, we have the little Tarzan Teeny and Friends. This is Miss Bippity and Boo. They had their little photo shoot and Bippity has a Tarzan boyfriend in this one. You have Tarzan, Jane, and then you have Boo dressed up as an elephant, as a monkey, and then sticking out of the little music record thing. The gramophone? Is that what it's called? So that's the first page. The second release is Kisma Urine Sample. And you might be like, what the heck is a urine sample? But if you ever go to the doctor, especially if you are pregnant, they take a urine sample every single time you go in to test for like proteins. And I don't even know what they test for in your urine, but they ask for it every time. Or if you're just doing a physical, if you're just getting a checkup, you probably will have to do a urine sample. You can also use this if you are doing at home ovulation predictor kits or pregnancy tests or there's just a lot of reasons why you would have your pee inside of a cup. So here is Miss Kisma with her urine sample. The next one kind of goes with it. This is Kisma Shot. This could be used for any time you're getting your blood drawn or if you are getting a shot. You could also use this if your children are getting shots because I know that I am super grumpy when James has to get shots. I absolutely hate it. I hate to see him in pain, so I just thought that Kisma being grumpy with a big needle was a good sheet to release. And then last but not least, we have our sweet little teeny tots playing with blocks. They are so cute. So James has been obsessed with blocks and Legos and um, Hot Wheels cars lately, so I'm trying to release some teeny tots that kind of like are like little kids playing. So these are teeny tots blocks. So that was everything that released yesterday. So that's just one of four release weeks that we're going to do in this video. It's gonna be a long one, but it is worth it to see all the goodies. Moving on to last week's releases, which includes one of my best-selling kits, like for the last year. This one probably sold more than any other kit in the last year. And that is my Little Mermaid inspired collection. This is called Thingamabob and it is the most perfect summer collection I could imagine. I love it so, so much. This Disney line that I've been putting out is my favorite line that I've ever released, and this is so, so good for the summer. Her hair is like the most luscious shade of red. I love this so much, and you guys did too, because this sold like crazy. Definitely the best selling of all of the princess kits that I've released. So thingamabob, first of all, you do have your full boxes, which is just so, so, so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love it. I cannot wait to use this in my own planner. You have check boxes, extra boxes, functional, deco and scripts, headers and washi, icons and littles, duo, bottom washi, glitter washi, and date covers, and I did use this longer, taller font. I thought it worked best with this collection. You also get your glitter headers included in the Lux. You get your extra boxes, which is just a flat lay scene of a bunch of Little Mermaid inspired things. And then look at this double box, I'm dying. This is the best part of the collection, I think. This is such a pretty scene, I love it. And you guys, this collection had glitter hollow foil overlays. I cannot wait to show you. It's like the prettiest thing we've ever done. But I do wanna say quickly that we did have this available also in a mini and a bitty. So these are the four bitty boxes. But you guys need this one in a luxe because it's 
so good with the foil overlays. I cannot wait to show you. But first, I am going to show you that we do have the A5 and personal side washi option and the label add-on that you can add on if you want. So let's get into these foil overlays because they are incredible. We do have three different foil overlays for this. We have thingamabob full boxes in glitter hollow. We have thingamabob extras in glitter hollow. And we have glitter hollow washi. This one is not collection specific, so you can get this and use it as glitter hollow overlays on any washi that you want. And it does have the half cut headers up here but it looks so good on this collection. So first of all, this is what it looks like over the bottom washi of the thingamabob collection. And I do not think that this lighting is gonna do this justice. Let's see if we can get, oh, there we go. You can see it a little bit there. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Okay, so that's what the washi looks like on the thingamabob washi. And then this is the full boxes. Oh my gosh, you guys. The camera is not even doing it justice. It's so good. It is so sparkly in real life. It is like the prettiest thing ever, ever. It's so, so good. And then the extra boxes have four full boxes here, the um, double box, and then a couple half cut headers down here. So these two top ones are going to go over your extra boxes in the luxe. And then these bottom two are going to go over your extra scene that's included also in the Lux. And then you do have the double box overlay as well, making the sky and the water sparkly so, so good. This collection just has me having all sorts of feels. The next new release from last week was the second most popular voted back summer kit for me to bring back. And this is called Freshly Squeezed. It is such a beautiful summer kit. My favorite box is this one down here that says too hot for the weather. I just think that's really cute in the little cat. It's very cute, very different. And if you did not pick this one up last year, um, it does have a lot of extra bits. Like I included a lot of extra boxes, so you'll see. So even if you did use this last year, you could use it again and make it look different. So here are the full boxes, so pretty. You have your check boxes, your extra boxes, functional, deco and scripts, headers and washi, littles and icons bottom washi glitter washi date covers. I'm loving these new date covers, loving. And then the Lux comes with a bunch of extra things. So you do get your tall fashion girls. Um, these are new. I did have tall fashion girls, I'm pretty sure before, but it was a totally different girl. And then you have a double box. Last year's did not come with a double box. So this is a new addition and you get your glitter headers. And then this collection has a lot of extras. So first of all, you can get the um, mini kit, of course, and also the bitty, which looks like this. Um, I do have a version two full box available for the Lux or the mini, so you can select this if you would prefer these boxes instead. We do have the A5 and personal side washi. I'm loving this floral print. We have the label add-on, and then we do have four fashion girl add-ons, and these are gonna give you four extra boxes. So this is version one. This was the tall girl last year and I thought she looked better as a regular full-size box this year. So you do have version one, version two, version three, and version four. So that was freshly squeezed. And then the last new collection release is actually kind of an old collection makeover. I don't think I've ever done this before, but I did have this collection go out as the June Mystery Kit 2018. So it's an older collection. That's why we do have the older format of the Essentials and the old format mini here. So this collection went out in 2018. It never came to the shop as overstock, even though at the time all my mystery kits did come to the shop as overstock. I'm not sure why. This one, oh, I think I remember why. Wasn't James born in June of 2018? He was, he was. So that's why it never came to the shop. It just, that was like a crazy month, obviously. So this collection we found in a box and I just said, you know what? I'm gonna kind of make it over and release it. So what I've done is I have added a add-on pack to all of the Lux kits. 
So with the add-on pack, you get two extra pages. You do get the newly formatted date covers and washi. And then you also get this page of functional stickers because as you'll see when I go through it, the functional stickers that were in the format in 2018 are a little bit different. So I wanted to update it along with just giving you a lot of extra stickers to play with. So if you purchase the Lux kit on the shop, you're automatically going to get the add-on pack included. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you what else comes with the kit, just so you can get a good idea. This is so cute, it's exclusive art. It's called Pink Home. I don't think I've said that yet, Pink Home. So first we have the full boxes. My phone is going off. We have check boxes. This is the old format functional page. So you do get a lot extra rounded half boxes and rounded quarter boxes, which you don't get anymore. And then the deco page with more functional stickers. You do have your icons here, stackable sidebar, date covers, but you do have the new format date covers that you can use. And then this was when I was doing the full page of headers and littles. And then this was the old format bottom washi, which you can totally slice up and still use in some way. But like I said, you do get the new format bottom washi date covers and you get this functional page here. And then you do get the double box scene, you get the glitter headers, and you get these tall fashion girls. So that is Pink Home. And if you did want to pick up, either if you have this collection and you haven't used it yet, and you want to pick up these extra pages, I do have them available as an add-on a la carte, so you can get these two pages together. Or if you wanted to pick up either the essentials or the mini, you can still add this on a la carte. And I also put up the glitter headers, the double box, and the fashion girls a la carte so that you can add them to these two sizes if that is what you would prefer to do. They are all on sale, all the sizes. So they're less than they originally were, even with the extra add-on pack for the Lux. So I haven't shown you an essentials or an old format mini in a long time. I'm just gonna quickly show you what this looks like because this is a retired format, but for the essentials, you did get your seven full boxes, five check boxes. This was originally formatted to work perfectly in my foiled inserts. That's why there's like certain things missing. And then you have headers, littles, you have your um, rounded boxes down here. And then your third page comes with just a bunch of functional stickers and your A5 washi. So you can pick this up and you can add on the add-on pack. Um, this one did come with a double box. So you wouldn't need to get that a la carte, but you could get glitter headers or whatever you want. And then this is the mini version, old format mini. So I will show you what this looks like. So you have four full boxes, but these are a little bit shorter. They work really well in the horizontal. Um, you could obviously just use it and white out a little bit in your Erin Condren. And then these are like mid-size boxes. I forgot about these boxes. I actually really used to like this size, but I don't think it would really work with the new style of having like so much and like doing day extenders and stuff. Like this was when you had a lot less to put in your planner. Then you have your um, two extra boxes down here. Wait, were these? smaller boxes. Now I can't remember. Maybe they weren't. Maybe that was a different format. It's been a while since. Okay. I think these are actually full size boxes. Um, you have two more down here. You have your weekend banner icons, and then you have some headers. You have another full box there, a stackable sidebar, and then you have more deco and more functional stickers. So this was the old format mini and all of these items are available. On the shop, on sale, um, the Lux is the only one that comes with the add-on pack included, but you can get you know, that a la carte, like I said. So then I wanted to show you, I did release header overlays. And the reason I did this is because in the new reformat of collection, I removed the majority of to do today and littles. And that was the majority of people wanted me to do that. Um, but there were customers who, really like having those to do today and littles headers. So what I decided to do was offer them in clear overlays that you could overlay over your glitter headers. And you can get this in any color you want. You can get it in black, gold, silver, rose gold, or glitter hollow. So here I have the gold to show you and also the glitter hollow to show you. And I do offer them in two different fonts. So this is the classic font. This is the font that the original headers were in. And then this is what I'm calling the scripts font because this is what I'm doing my custom scripts in. So if you're buying a lot of custom scripts, then using this one, it would just match a little bit better. But honestly, 
they both would work. So we do have this in all the colors and they are cut header size so you can just line them up perfectly with your glitter headers and work them that way. You could also probably put these over existing kits if you have to do today in Littles. I'm assuming they'd match up perfectly. I'm not sure though, you'd have to try. So those were header overlays. And then lastly for this past week, I do have some teeny and friends to show you guys. So first of all, we have Miss Kisma guzzling wine. So she's drinking out of one wine glass and she has the other one in her other hands. You know, sometimes you need this. And then we also have Miss Kisma cramping. I don't know if you guys have put two and two together, but I was having a really bad PMSing cramping day when I decided on these two Kisma releases. I was drinking wine and I was cramping and I was like, you know what? These are the two that I need this week. So there you go. We also have Teeny Tots Celebrate that you could use for a birthday, a baby shower, a milestone, Anytime you want to celebrate something that your little has done, you can use Teeny Tots Celebrate. So we do have version one and version two. Next, we have the girls walking. So this was a mystery teeny subscription, I think a few years ago, and I have brought it back for Teeny Tuesday in the past, but I just wanted it to be like a staple item that's always on the shop. So we do have all five girls walking and they do have a little Fitbit on their wrist. So we have Miss Teeny. Lolly, Bippity, Honey, and Polka. So all of the girls walking. So that was everything that released this past week. Oh, two more release weeks to go. You guys, I've been pumping out new stuff. Like it's crazy that I have so many collections to show you in this video. Like even though I haven't done a new release video in four weeks, I feel like in the past four weeks worth of releases would not be as much as I have right now. I have just been on a roll. You guys have been really inspiring me. It's been incredible. So the week before that, which was the June 12th week, we only had one collection released that week, um, but it was a really special collection. So let me grab it. I just found this on my desk. Totally forgot to show you in the last batch, but we do have Miss Lolly and Pop as Ariel. So you have her as a mermaid, her as a human, and then you have Flounder, the eel, and Sebastian. So that is our little Ariel teeny and friends sheep. So moving on to three weeks ago, the June 12th release. Like I said, I did only have one collection, but it's exclusive art and it's absolutely beautiful. This is Miss Tiana inspired and it is called Almost There after the song. It is so pretty. It's very New Orleans-y because that movie does take place in New Orleans. So you do have Tiana and Lottie and you have some beignets. You have like a po' boy here, a shrimp po' boy. You do have the frog, of course, because it's the princess and the frog retelling. So I will show you what comes in the luxe. Of course, I do also have this in a mini and a bitty, but First of all, you have your full boxes, which I just showed you. You have your check boxes. Your extra boxes are like a trolley car, and then your functional deco and scripts, washi and headers, loving these colors too, icons and littles, dual bottom washi, glitter washi, and date covers. I think this might have been the first collection that I debuted these new date covers in. And then you do get three extras in the luxe. You get your beautiful New orleans -y glitter headers, you get this gorgeous double box, and you get these two extra boxes which are a little bit more like dark voodoo kind of themed. I wanted to keep these separate from the main boxes in case you don't want to like go the voodoo direction in your collection, but it is part of the movie. So it's also very, very authentic to New Orleans. I did live in New Orleans before. So um, yeah, it's New Orleans authentic and I absolutely love this collection. So like I said, we do have it available in a mini and a bitty as well. These are the bitty boxes. And then we do have the A5 and personal side washi option and the label add-on option for this collection. So this collection was so good that I just felt like it was a good standalone collection for the week. I was really happy to release this and you guys absolutely loved it. So in addition to that, I did release a charity script sampler for Black Lives Matter. So this is a Black Lives Matter script sampler, like I just said, and it has time to talk, vote, sign petitions, rally, 
Listen and Learn, Protest, Black Lives Matter, and Take Action. And you can get this in all the foil colors. So this is the Glitter Hollow. And then this is just black if you want to do that. But we also have gold, silver, and rose gold available as well. This is a charity sample sampler. So 100% of the money made from it are going to be going to the NAACP at the end of June. So um, this was something that was requested on Facebook. And I was very happy to whip it up for you guys. So that was the bulk of what released that week. I did have some... Teeny and Friends also released that I will show you. First of all, we released probably Kisma's best seller, and this was Kisma Nope. So she is reminiscent of the Mondays girl, case of the Mondays. She has her big sunglasses on and the Nope cup in her hand. Honestly, you could use this like every day for something. We also have the girls with two kids. So they're holding the hand of a toddler and then holding a baby in their other arm. And the little outfits on the kids are blue and pink combined. So they are gender neutral and you can use them for no matter what um, genders your two kids are. But I thought that that was cute. And then also I did bring back the hugging dad. We did do hugging mom um, a few weeks ago. This was a sub a few years ago, a mystery teeny. I did want to have it brought back to the shop because this would work well for Father's Day or any father bonding that you might have. So we do have all five of the girls with their dads and that is called hugging dad. And last but certainly not least, we have Miss Polka as Tiana and her little dot as the alligator, the frog, and the little voodoo man. So you do have the two outfits of Tiana, her beautiful green dress and her waitressing outfit. And then you do have the little panda dressed up as the characters as well. So I have been loving releasing these Teeny and Friends um, Disney sheets to coordinate with the Disney line that I've been releasing. It's so good. So that was the release week for three weeks ago. We're almost there, you guys. We have one more week of releases to share, although this one last week was a really big week. We had three collections. Two of them were exclusive. We had a binder bundle, and we had a bunch of Teeny and Friends. So let me collect all of that, and I'll be right back. These released on June 5th, and like I said, there's two exclusive art collections and then a reformat. So I'm going to start with my Disney line for the week. This is called Voyager, and it is a Moana inspired collection of course and how gorgeous is this like this bathroom scene are you kidding me I would love to have a bathtub that looks like that looking over like a rainbow and the ocean and she's just so good like she's gorgeous um Maui is perfect Poe and hey hey like it's just so good I'm loving the curly girl method hair products they're like just so good I love it so, like I said, this is called Voyager, and in the Lux, you do get your full boxes. I'm loving the brightness of the colors, your check boxes. Look at this extra scene. It's just so good. I want to live there. Your functional stickers, deco and scripts, headers and washi, icons and littles, dual bottom washi, glitter washi, and date covers. Yeah, this was before um, I did the new style of date covers. And then in the Lux, you do get your extra boxes to help extend your kit. You get this beautiful double box and you get your glitter headers. So that was the Lux. Of course, I do have this available in a mini and a bitty as well. And then I also have the label add-on and the A5 and personal side washi, which is like a sand um, pattern. The next exclusive art collection that was released is called Dino Party, and this was the collection that I had commissioned for James's second birthday because he's obsessed with dinosaurs, but I also thought that this would just be a really cute collection to use for any type of baby shower, baby party, not even for your own kids necessarily. I mean, definitely for your own kids, but also just for anything that you're going to go to. This is just a really cute kid-friendly celebration kit that you can use for different things. So this is what I'm going to be using for James's birthday week. It's so, so cute. I love it. I love the colors. They're very muted. I'm obsessed with the dinosaurs. They're just so cute. So this could be especially good for a baby shower. This could be especially good for a party of any sort, and that's for a birthday. So honestly, this is just a very celebratory kit. Pet boxes, extra boxes, functional deco and scripts headers and washi icons and littles 
dual bottom washi glitter washi date covers and you do get this cave um, double box with like some dinosaur eggs. I thought that was so cute. And then you do get your glitter headers. And I did try to keep the colors gender neutral for this collection so that you can use it whether it's a girl or a boy that you're celebrating. And then of course I have it in the mini and the bitty. These are the bitty boxes. And I do have fashion baby add-ons for this one to really personalize your kit. So we do have the A5 and personal side washi, the label add-on, and then these are the little cutie um, fashion toddler add-on. So you do have a boy version and a girl version, and then you have just an extra scene box in the middle. So this is version one, version two, version three, and version four. And the version four girl has like curly hair. She's so cute. Okay. So that was Dino Party. And then the last collection for this video and for the June 5th release week was a reformat of last year's Noir Nights. And I love this. I ended up adding extra boxes that were not in last year's version. And I also did different fashion girls just to kind of update it a little bit. And I love it. So this is just such a cute monochromatic stay at home collection. This was released four weeks ago and it's just really good for like the quarantine. I'm just loving the color scheme. Sometimes you just want something monochromatic in your planner and I just love the aesthetic of this. This box is new here, the one with the bath overlooking the city. So you have your check boxes. Um, both of these boxes are new from last year's version and I think the colors are a little bit updated as well. And then your functional page, your deco and scripts, headers and washi, icons and littles, dual bottom washi, glitter washi, and date covers. And the Lux comes with your glitter headers. These colors are really pretty. Your double box, which is like a bedroom scene looking over a city. And then also these are new fashion girls. So, um, Actually, these three look really similar on camera, coloring wise, but they are slightly different colors. This artist does do dark red hair. So we have blonde, red, and then we have like a lighter brown and a black hair. But I thought this was really pretty and I just liked it better than last year's Fashion Girls that I had. So I just wanted to update it a little bit. So that was Noir Nights Luxe. I do have it in a mini, I have it in a bitty. These are the four boxes. And then I do have the label add-on and the A5 and personal side washi for that. So last but not least, we do have some Teeny and Friends that released during this release week. So this one is called Gray Baby Snuggles and it's the girls with their little baby snuggling and it's called Gray Baby Snuggles because I have another color. I can't remember if it's purple or pink that hasn't released yet. Or actually, I think I have a blue one too. I'm not sure. Anyway, this is the gray version. It kind of will work with like any color scheme that you have in your planner when you're snuggling with your sweet little baby. And then we also have the Moana Teeny and Friends. So you have Moana, Maui, Hey Hey, the crab, the crazy crab, and then Poa. So this is Miss Honey and Bun dressed up in her Moana photo shoot. And it's gorgeous. I'm loving these Disney line collections. Next, we have three Kismas. We do have Kisma Birthday. So this is her holding balloons and Ass is next to her. And I think Ass is wearing a birthday hat. Yeah, he is. So cute. Then we have Kisma Crying for days that you're just under the weather with your mood. You're just like feeling sad. We all have those days. And then we have Kisma cooking and she's actually burning whatever's in her pan. Like there's a little fire coming out of it. So freaking cute. Kisma is just the best. And then also I did forget to show you, but we did have a binder bundle released this week as well, which is the, um, we haven't had binder bundles in a while, but this one is called Midnight Hollow and it is not on transparent paper. It's actually on black backing. And so this you would use differently than you would use the transparent ones because you wouldn't put it over, you would put it under your other stickers. So obviously the date covers, you could put the dates right over top. The dates are down here. Um, these border stickers, you wouldn't put over your functional stickers. You would just use them as is and then put um, 
you know, your characters or your scripts on top. These you would use by themselves as washi strips because they're not transparent, obviously. And then this is all um, like different box sizes and half cut headers. So you could use this in the background if you wanted to hollow, midnight hollow, bougie your spread up. And then this one, you have your icons, you have more boxes here, and then you have some um, what typically on transparent paper would be full box overlays, but you could actually put these under your functional stickers. So I know that a lot of people purchase this to use with their Noir Nights collection because it is so monochromatic. So that would be really pretty because it is very black, but then you do have the hollow, which really kind of pulls out the purple tones in this collection. So it's really pretty, but this also would be a good one to have on hand for some of the Halloween collections coming out. Like imagine this with a Halloween collection or someone messaged me and said that this would be really cute with my conspiracy collection. So, I mean, there's lots of ways that you could use this, but this is the Midnight Hollow Binder Bundle. So that is everything that is released in the last four weeks for the month of June. There are so many things here. Let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten collections, tons of teenies, some foil. It's been a really good month. I hope you guys enjoyed all of these releases. I am going to try to get back into doing them weekly because this was just chaos. This is going to be a long video, but I did want to put this up because I do think it's valuable to be able to like explain the kits to you, show you them up close and all of that and like you can see little details that maybe you wouldn't have seen just by looking at the picture. The first set of releases that I showed you with the Tarzan and the palm leaves, that is still in the new release section of the shop because that just released yesterday. But these other items you'll have to search for on the shop. They are all still on the shop. They should be in stock. If any of these items are not in stock, I will restock them for you guys. If you just leave me a message or tell me on Facebook or write me an email, um, I will restock them because you know we're doing this video. So I want you guys to get, be able to get your hands on these products, but you will need to use the search bar and probably search for the collections or the teenies in question because they're not gonna be easily accessible in the new release section the way the most current collection like new releases are hope that makes sense. Anyway, now I'm just rambling. I'm going to go eat some lunch. I am starving. I will see you guys later. Goodbye.